Oh, they're certainly the two most. And welcome to Old Trafford for one of the definitive games in English football. I'm talking, of course, about Manchester United against Liverpool. Derek Ray in the commentary position, joined by Stuart Robson. I must say the Stratford end in fine voice already. What a match this promises to be, Stuart. Well, you're absolutely right. Old Trafford is rocking here. The noise is incredible. Let's hope we get a great game to match. This will be a feisty affair, that's for sure. Is it going to be? Oh, blocked it! This is the team Manchester United will go with. Luke Shaw starts with Aaron Wan-Bissaka in the fullback positions. Bruno Fernandes plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And this is how Liverpool will line up. Alisson begins in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. Well, he's a player who just seems to get better and better. I'm talking, of course, about Bruno Fernandes. Stuart, what do you think we'll see from him in this game? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas. Oh, big chance here! They had to react, and did. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Must take the lead here. A goal! They've opened the scoring in the derby. And I'll tell you what, you can hear a pin drop in here. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing. What a goal. So United restart the game. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they come up with an equaliser? Mount. And support available. It's a perfect challenge. So Bosloy. Encouraging move from Liverpool. But nothing comes of it. Juan Bisaka. Now Casemiro. And the Liverpool throw in forthcoming. So Bosloy. Options in the centre. Robertson. Can he put it away? Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Bruno Fernandes. Anthony. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, we're on the cusp of the half-time interval with United narrowly behind. Stuart, what have you made of their performance in the first 45? Well, I've been a little disappointed with their attacking play. It's all been a bit too slow. If they can pass it into their front areas with more quality, switch play quicker and be more positive in 1v1 situations, I think they'll get back into this. High quality defending.
space on the flank. And in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. We certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. And the referee gets the second half going. Liverpool with the lead. Will they be able to hold on to it? McAllister, well, the attack looks promising. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Being pressed and pressed high. Bruno Fernandes. Marcus Rashford. Could cross it in here. Bruno Fernandes. Can they square the game? Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Keen to take it short here. Mount. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Counter attacking very much an option. Mount. Rashford. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Number 14, Christian Eriksen. Substitution for Liverpool. Coming off the pitch, number 10, Alexis McAllister. Alexis to go short. Number 14, Bruno Fernandes. Now with Casimiro. Well, those stats don't lie. Liverpool haven't controlled the ball, but when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas, and then counter-attack quickly. Oh, look at this, Stuart, an opportunity. Not all that convincing defensively. Fabinho. Determined defending. Into the final 20 minutes. Well, with the support of these fans, United are throwing everything at this now. Moving the ball nicely, trying to carve out the equaliser. Under real pressure defensively, will they pay the price? Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Casemiro. Bruno Fernandes has it. Rashford. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Well, I think the fans are doing everything they can to get their team back into this. But can they find that moment of inspiration and get an equaliser? Curtis Jones. Looking away patiently, looking for an opening. Can he convert? And a really good diving stop.
taken short. Jones. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Mo Salah. Bonatti. Just made sure nothing came of that. Ibrahima Konate. They've regained possession. Anthony. And Rashford. The referee's whistle for full time. And here's the big story. No points at all for Manchester United. Well, Derek, it was a poor result, but it was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances, could have gone either way, but in the end, they will be disappointed. And I think it's fair to say he'll be happy with his own contribution in this game, Stuart. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today, 